The declaration made by Donald Trump that the United States recognizes Jerusalem as the capital city of Israel was a reckless mistake. We don't know yet what the repercussions are going to be, but clearly there are, this was an, an enormous insult to the entire Arab and Muslim world, and a boost for Israel, for Benjamin Netanyahu, and for Israeli settlers. Jerusalem has been a Muslim and Arab city for 1,500 years, and this was only interrupted in 1948 when the State of Israel was established, and then, in violation of international law and United Nations resolutions, went on to conquer the city of Jerusalem. At that point, it had only taken the western part of the city, and then it began a massive campaign of ethnic cleansing in which the entire population of western Jerusalem was forced to leave, their homes were taken, in fact, in my book, The General Son, I describe how my mother was offered an Arab home in one of these uh, neighborhoods, and um, of course she refused to take the home of another family. But the entire western part of the city has been uh, completely cleansed of um, its Arab population, who are now all refugees. Twenty years later, Israel took on the, uh, the eastern part of the city. In fact, it was 1967, and Israel completed its conquest of all of Palestine. Having taken the, the eastern part of Jerusalem, it continued its campaign of ethnic cleansing, brutally destroying entire neighborhoods and villages and towns adjacent to Jerusalem, and building massively for Israeli Jews only. The old city of Jerusalem, which is within the eastern part of the city, uh, continues to be um, under this campaign. House by house, alley by alley, are being taken over by Jewish settlers and Palestinian families are quite literally being thrown into the streets. Um, this recognition basically legitimizes the crime of ethnic cleansing. It legitimizes Israel's campaign of de-Arabizing and ridding the city of Jerusalem of its Arab heritage and <clears throat> excuse me, trying to erase the Arab and Muslim history of this magnificent city. And again, the only person that has anything to gain from this was Benjamin Netanyahu. For him, this was an enormous political boost. No other Israeli prime minister was ever able to achieve um, or to receive this kind of recognition from an American president. Uh, I believe that the Green Party of the U.S. offers us a way forward. Um, the campaign for boycott, divestment, and sanctions, the BDS campaign, is the right way forward. And the calling for the state of Israel to make way for a real democracy to be established over all of Palestine with equal rights. That is the answer, I believe, uh, to this reckless decision. Thank you very much.